Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create this animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first one, select this hand layer one and go to solo and go to anchor point, move the anchor point up, click tool and on solo, select layer hand two, go to solo and move the anchor point here and click tool on solo. Select hand to link to hand one layer. Select hand one layer, link to body. And select hand one and go to solo again for left hand and move the anchor point up. Clicization tool and select hand two, go to solo, move the anchor point down. Clicization tool and unsolo. Select hand two, link to hand one. Select hand one, link to body. And select body, go to solo, move the anchor point down. Clicization tool and unsolo. Select layer eyes and eyebrow, link to head layer. Select head layer, link to body. And select mouth layer, let's delete and I will use lip sync animation. Let's drag and drop into the conversation and let's move to here. Press S, change scale. Let's zoom in like this, change scale more and link to head layer. So let's close scale and right mouse, go to time and time stretch. Change stretch factor 150. Click OK for more slow animation. OK, let's control D for duplicate and move to right. And select work area for 8 seconds. And right mouse, trip come to work area. Okay, that's good. So, select these eyes and press S. Let's click scale chief frame and click this icon, go to three chief frames. For go to frame by frame chief frames, you can press page down. One, two, three. Change scale five. Again, one, two, three. Select first shift frame, copy pass. Make it easy. And move to right. Let's see. Okay, select these shift frames. Let's copy, go to here, and paste randomly bleak animation. Nice. And select this eyebrow layer. Go to here. And press P. Let's create new passing shift frame. And go to 10 chip frames. For shortcut, you can press Hold Shift Page Down Keyboard. And let's move to down. Let's see. And make the chip frames easy. And go to here. Let's create new person chip frame. Go to 10 chip frames. Move to up. Again, go to same chip frames. Create new person chip frame. Go to 10 chip frames. And move to down. Let's see. Okay, select two frames, let's copy, go to here, control V. So let's close two frame settings and select this body. Go to first second, let's press R and create new rotation two frame, go to 10 two frames, chain rotation minus three or minus four. Let's see. Okay, and go to 5 shift frames, create new rotation shift frame, go to 10 shift frames, change 3. And select shift frames, right click, shift frame assistant and easy or click F9. So, go to here, again let's create new rotation shift frame, go to 10 shift frames, change 0. And select work area. So, in this time, select this hand layer, hand 1, go to first second, and let's press R and create new rotation two frame. select hand 2, also press R, create rotation two frame, and go to here, we can follow these two frames, and let's move to like this, let's see, okay, and this, let's move to down like this, Say two frames, make it easy. Nice. And select this body for add bounce animation. Go to first second, hold shift, press P. 
and create new parts in QFrame, go to middle and move to down. And go to here, select first QFrame, copy paths and make it easy. Let's see. Okay, and let's go to here. Again, let's create new hand QFrames. Go to like this and chain rotation again to back and this zero go to again last shift frame create new hand Q frames go to here and change this zero and this hand so let's close Q frame settings and let's select this head layer go to first second and go to solo move the anchor point to down let's unsolo okay we can move to here click station tool press r create rotation Q frame and go to 10 Q frames chain rotation like this okay and here let's create new rotation Q frame go to 10 Q frames chain rotation to right and here let's create new rotation go to 10 Q frames change to like this and select Q frames make it again easy nice so in this time select head layer for add bounce animation go to first second hold shape press p and create new passing in frame go to middle move to down go to next Q frame select first Q frame copy pass and make the Q frames easy okay say Q frames copy and go to here control v and here control v for paste nice and finally select this hand one layer let's see okay select hand two press r and create rotation Q frame and chain rotation like this go to 10 Q frames change here let's write 10 okay and let's chain rotation like this go to 10 Q frames change like this again 10 Q frames say first Q frame copy pass and make it easy and preview animation okay let's add loop expression for endless animation hold alt click time icon go to play button prepare to end loop out duration and for down expression click this empty area let's see nice so guys thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel like video leave comments and have a good day good luck